Welcome to another episode of This Is Anything Girls, and today we will be using a hacksaw on our next, not really a project, but more of an experiment. So I hope you stay till the end of this video. What we will be cutting up is a radiator. So you probably saw in my previous video where I changed the radiator of the Myvi, and this is the old radiator. As you can see, there are coolants here. The thing was cracked over here but one thing i want to actually see because on a video prior to that i actually made a another video that i flushed the radiator and not much things came out which was surprising considering the age of this radiator so what we'll do is we'll take this apart and see if there's any rust or debris or anything inside it okay so if there isn't that means the flush was good this was a very reasonable shape uh, radiator but if there is rust and gunk and everything inside it then I'll say that radiator flushing may not work so let's open this up and have a look all right Okay, still a bit rusty. Let's look at the bottom side. Okay, let's remove the bottom as well and have a look. I suspect it's most likely going to be the same as the top. Yeah, it looks pretty decent actually. So if we look at it, everything seems good. So the only reason why it was not usable was because the top here cracked. So let's see if we can find the cracks. Yes, you can. You can see the crack over here. Let me just put it like that. Yeah, you can see the cracks over here. Here. Basically, this whole top mount is not usable anymore. Okay, and then on the top side, it seems to be good as well. This, this actually did went through an accident, so you see that is compressed over here yeah so overall this was actually a good condition radiator except for the top mount that was leaking well maybe it was because of the flush that's why it's so clean but if you remember correctly during the flush there was not much rust coming out of it as well so I don't think we need to cut this up because even if we did cut it up, I don't think we will find much. Because if you see, there isn't that bad of a... You can actually see through it. Focus is difficult, but you can see the light on the other side. 
and there's not much of uh, rust in between okay so in conclusion does flushing your radiator works so in the event that your radiator is not that badly um, clogged up yes yes it works as you can see over here it still is a pretty much functional radiator you just need to replace the top and the bottom mount this is the top as you saw it was cracked this is the bottom which has the additional one pipe here that was meant for the weirdly enough for the oil the gearbox oil which is odd because it doesn't seem to have a, another pipe inside the pipe and that's I don't know it doesn't really make sense to me but yeah okay okay interesting very very interesting okay so if you like this video hit this if you dislike it you can always hit this but leave us a comment down below on how to improve further and if you have not really done so make sure you hit the subscribe like and bell button so you get notified on our next upload until then i will see you again